today I'm going just again for another experiment because gel plate printing is basically experimenting. Sometimes it comes out with something that you really like and sometimes not so much, but it's fun to play with. So I'm going to start with the background. I'm using an 8x10 uh, gel plate uh, with the 9x12 paper uh, from Canson. And um, once again, let's see what we can come up with. I have leftover stuff on my gel plate from the last time uh, that I did a video. So let's see how that goes. So I'm just going to mix this in uh, the white, titanium white golden fluid acrylics. That's mainly what I use most of the time, mixed with yellow ochre golden fluid acrylics. And just Smoke it out. And try not to leave too much paint. Now I've had this uh, screen men, uh, you know, like if your window screen gets a hole. You can buy these little men squares. It's called screen men. And I had it sitting around. I was just wondering with these fine um, square holes in it, if I can get some type of um, imprint from it. Yes, we can. Pretty nifty since I didn't use it for the purpose that I purchased it for. It's no better time than now to try to use it. Okay. I also have this uh, wooden uh, stamp. Put some imprints of that on just randomly. Just adding texture to the plate. Let's take a pull. Let's see what we get. You'll hear all kinds of little noises in the background, perhaps. There you have it. It's pretty cool. You can see the screen imprint and the wood block print. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah.